And when you think of art, chances are you picture paintings or sculptures, not sticks. But in today's Discover DFW, Madison shows us an art display that's turning heads in Fort Worth and bringing a whole new appreciation to the beauty that can be found from our natural surroundings. The Fort Worth Botanic Gardens is known for its natural beauty. There are unique gardens and greenery all around. But as you wander along the path, a mystical forest begins to appear. It's pretty unique and it's certainly engaging. It's called stick work. It's sort of like a maze. Uh, it's sort of like a castle, you know. It, it brings up all kinds of images to mind. A work of art created from tens of thousands of sticks. It's the vision of Patrick Doherty. It's everywhere from about a half an inch and three feet long all the way to these big pieces that were two and a half to three inches in diameter and were 25 feet long. Specific species of trees with branches capable of bending and flexing were chosen. And the last thing that he did was to come back after everything was in place and use these pieces, which are small American elm saplings, to kind of finish out every edge. Fascinating. It kind of gives it that yeah. finished look. Yeah. Creating a magical place where adults and children alike can explore and let their imaginations run wild. And it's really interesting to watch because people get kind of meditative and uh, when they're just looking at it, you know, as an object. But then when they start interacting with it, you you get this kind of inner child coming out in people all the way into their 60s and 70s. All made from sticks. And he said, I was a young artist and I was poor, but sticks were free. So this was something that I could afford to do. An art exhibit that will remain on display awaiting discovery until Mother Nature decides its time has run out. The plan with these is that you just leave them in place until they start to naturally go the way of the world and deteriorate. And this is frankly one of the most engaging things like this that I've run into in a long time. So I think there's a lot of really good reasons to come out and see the garden and enjoy stickworks. Now, typically, the structures will actually last between two to three years. So, Karen, there is plenty of time to go out and visit the Botanic Garden and marvel at the very unique artwork. Madison, I have to say, when I read your story, I, not having seen it, I was thinking, you know, sticks, you know, just let it, like, what is it, you know, on a piece of cardboard? That is incredible. I mean, it really does look like something out of uh, a fantasy. H how long did it take him to build it? Well, the staff told me that the artist, Patrick Doherty, and his son actually assembled the structures over a three week period, which fell in the middle of the snowstorm that hit North Texas in February. And despite the freezing temperatures, the ice, the snow, he only missed one day of working on his masterpiece. So, obviously, very dedicated to his work. Right, and he's got to be hoping that it never falls apart. <laughs> All right, thank you so much, Madison.